looks like you're going to have teammates side by side going through turn one and two. Harvick in the 29 pushing McMurray. 42 getting a push by Denny Hamlin in the outside, it's side whichever, by side. It's whichever line back here where you see the 56 coming. If he goes with the 29, that will push them ahead of the 42 Montoya and the 11. But he's got to get there, and he's not getting there. And Dale Jr. did not keep pace with Martin Truex. He's fallen back a bit. He will not be among those who will settle this for the win. Boy, they are. That's this is the roadblock now. Even when you get there, where look, are you going to go? Look at the run. Truex is getting in the 56 with the push from Kyle Busch in the 18. White flag this time. Can Montoya and Hamlin do the two by two tango, or will Harvick shove McMurray to victory lane? White flag in the wind. One lap to go. ECR engines at the front of the field working together and looking good. The big question, both those guys, they have to be on fumes as far as fuel, the one and the 29. I don't like that. There's a little bit nervous good getting a big way, lead out here. You got to be careful. But with these guys two by two behind them, it might work. Staying to the inside, the two leaders have no drafting help. But they are scooting away from the pack. Three corners to go. Now, Harvick, he'll keep pushing him, and he'll get over here to the travel, try to make the slingshot on him. As soon as he knows that he doesn't have to worry about that third place car of Montoya, he probably will try to make the move, although I don't know if it'll do him any good or not. Last chance through the trial. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here, he comes. here, he comes. here they come. Two laps to go. Remember, seven of the last 11 Talladega races decided by a last lap pass. Boyer and Harvick coming again on the high side. Yeah, Boyer got, he got real tight on the, the side of the 16 car, but it's paying off. Drag race down the back right there. But they can't clear the Fords and protect the bottom because Edwards comes storming back on the inside. Well, what else it does is opens the door for these two cats right here who have timed it out pretty darn good coming to the white flag. And there comes their teammates as well. Johnson and Earnhardt Jr. White flag this time. Those have been the two best cars right there. Most of this race. They're the, just now showing it. The bell lap and the man who started up front leads it. Jeff Gordon. But here comes the next two pair that these two cats right here, they may have timed it out too. Let's see what happens down the back. Now they will get a draft off Mark Martin. And here's the slingshot to the outside. Stay together. That's what they're saying. Stay together. Push, push, push. We get tight down here in turn three. Don't forget Jimmy Johnson and Dale Jr. Fifth and sixth. They are there. Which group will they go with? And will it help the Jimmy's cars? Or will it help Jeff Gordon to victory lane? All bets are off. They get to the middle of the travel. Watch out down low. Way Good down run. comes Johnson. Good run. Boy. He's got room. They're three wide. Three by three run. to the line. Johnson. Maybe Jimmy Johnson. I believe he got him by an inch. Two one thousandths of a second he beat Boyer. Okay, a sixteenth of an inch. Kieslowski was telling Kyle Busch, come on, let's go. But look at those two Fords. They just accelerate right, got on the bottom. Good choice on Matt Kenseth's part. Got his teammate behind him. The dust flies as those Fords try and fly away from the field. Don't want to get too far out there. You guys are clear by four. Look at that 17 car. This looks like Daytona all over again. Everybody can complained about Greg Biffle not trying to pass Matt. He said, I couldn't get to him. He can't get to him now. However, the field will accordion back together. Here comes Earnhardt with the 34 on the bottom. There's David the Reagan. guys you got to watch on the outside there. Here they come. Look the two at the, and the run. Keselowski in the two. Look at the run. He's getting there with that push from Kyle Busch. Did oh, Matt Kenseth get too far out in front, or is he setting up for this? The last lap as they come to the line, one to go. Well, he does, you don't want to lead on the last lap, but I'm not sure that that's going to work out the way Matt thought it was when this is the white flag lap. Junior up the outside, somebody steaming. In that pair, it's Kyle Busch, Casey and, Kane. And the problem with that, he's got no help. He's all by himself. But think about Kyle Busch. He lost the race yesterday by leading coming back to the checkered flag. And also think, think about, about the move in the trial over here. Right. Think about your... 
It's a two horse race. Clint Boyer's gone. Stanley Steamer up in turn number three. Hey, boys. A car length apart. Kyle Busch from Keselowski. It ain't over yet. Remember that start finish line. I don't think he's close enough, Daryl. I don't think he's close enough. Brad Keselowski pulling away. It's all happening behind him. And Keselowski, for the second time, will go to victory lane in Talladega. Wow. One lap to go. And it's a race from here on, no matter what happens. Johnson looked high. Kenseth to draft right, with Edwards. Johnson to the bottom. Come to the right top. Right Man, Matt got shuffled out again. Jimmy Johnson with Carl Edwards. But Kenseth up the middle, coming back. Help from David Reagan. Up to the bumper of Carl Edwards. Reagan in the middle. His teammate Gilliland is the pusher. The They're They'll right on the bumper the of Edwards. Is there, there anywhere go. to go? The Reagan to the bottom. Get Gilliland with him. David Reagan, July winner at Daytona a couple of years ago. Gilliland with him. Edwards up top. Michael Waltrip to help. And here they come off turn four. Push, boys. Push. Push hard. Edwards high. Reagan comes up. Carl Gilliland. on his spot. Gilliland. Reagan's Gilliland. got it. He's got it. Front row racing is in the victory lane at Talladega. Reagan first. Gilliland second. An unbelievable run there. Not a first-time winner, but a first-time Talladega winner. Look at those teammates. No, but this Great team, job, this Great team. Job. Bob Jenkins, the car owner, yeah. is. Uh, <laughs> they need to watch this race today. This is for the pole. Here they come to the line. Kurt Busch, Austin Dillon, Brian Scott. That Austin Dillon, Brian Scott, Brian Scott. That's Brian Scott. That's Brian Scott. Begins the race. Whoa, Josh Wise whoa. takes them four wide to the outside. Here they come. Whoa, whoa, trouble, trouble. Justin Allgaier. And there is debris on the racetrack. Plastic from Allgaier. No car. caution. White flag in the air. They're racing back. Daryl, there's a half of a bumper laying right in the middle of the front straightaway, right before the start finish line. I don't see a caution flag yet. I don't see anything happening. It's well, all green. It's just a piece of plastic. Here we go. Caution wave. Caution. Caution's out. Caution's out. Stay in front here. Stay in front. Caution is out. There's so it, debris here on the front. At the moment of caution, at the moment of caution, where every driver was at, that's pretty much where they fit. And Denny Hamlin has to come around to the flag, and it will be the checker because once the leader takes the white flag, the next flag freezes the field. The race is over, and Denny Hamlin goes to victory lane at Talladega, his first restrictor plate win. One to go. White flag. Martin Truex on the outside. Menard's coming with him. They'll never make it back. And Denny Hamlin They'll goes up there. We got back. one all the way on the apron spinning. Carl Edwards. No. And now there's the wreck. Three cars hard in the wall. Casey Mears, Ricky Stenhouse, Jeff Gordon around. Here come the leaders. We're still green. No still green. Come on, boys. Bring it to the house. Menard to the bottom with Blaney. Junior trying to hold everybody off. Come on, Blaney. You got one more shot. You can do it. Earnhardt, Johnson, Menard, Blaney, double wide behind them, four cars to settle it. Earnhardt trying to cover all spots. Dale, Earnhardt Jr., checkered flag at Talladega. Johnson second, Menard third, Blaney, Truex the top five. And one car in the wall coming to the line way up in the dust. That was Stenhouse who's wiped the whole right side off his car on the final lap. Pain to the bottom, trying to get something going. No help. Kurt Busch just had a big moment, lost a lot of momentum. He's going up Chase high. Chase Elliott to the middle. He's going to get a run here. Here comes a three car, going to try to give the eight. Chase Elliott breaks out of the pack up to fourth place. Yeah, but get he tight. get clear. He need to get up in front of that one car. I just don't think anybody's going to be able to get enough momentum to get a big big enough push to get by this too. This is the best thing gonna happen to him is them get side by side behind him. Just remember where the start finish line is. That's right, it's not in the middle of the tri-oval. Keselowski. Big run coming from the 18. Oh, the Kyle three stepped Bush, out. Dylan. 
Kyle Busch and Dylan Sott. Trouble. Car hard in the wall. Two of them. Keselowski to the line. Caution had waved with Keselowski the leader and crashing are Harvick, Almendinger, Stenhouse. Jimmy Johnson in the 48 gave Ricky Stenhouse a nice push. Now he gets one from the one of McMurray and here comes Johnson. Here they come. There comes Casey Kane. Ah! Oh, Stenhouse did a great job to block that run that was coming. Boy, he yeah, yeah, he's going to get to the inside right here. Great move by Ricky Stenhouse. Will he clear, clear up? Clear I think up, he clear will. Up. Come on, get Not up there. Not yet. Oh, We're past man. the overtime line. We have a race. Oh, we Next have a drag race. Is it? I tell you, I thought Stenhouse could have made a move up right there, but you can see he's pretty well. He's got some speed for the, he and the 7, 18 are pretty equal. Fastest car here carries Bush up the race. White flag trying to end a 101 race winless streak for car owner Jack Roush is Ricky Stenhouse. Look at this, four wide. Oh Everybody wants to get to the front. I just don't see how that's going to work out. Side drafter for McMurray on Casey Kane. He's going to get to the rear bumper. Or go in the middle between Jimmy Johnson and Kyle Busch. Now what's Stenhouse do? Can he block? Can he block all of them coming at once? Five wide. Work it, dude. Work it. Last lap. Oh, Bang. That was that Bush into one, McMurray. Half back to the bottom. Two. Stenhouse gets away a little bit. Three wide. Here they come off turn four. This is the finish these fans came and stayed for. Ricky Stenhouse, the pride of Olive Branch, Mississippi. Top to bottom. Kyle Busch to the outside gets blocked by Stenhouse. Here they come. Stenhouse yes. wins it. <laughs> Woohoo! What a run. What a thrilling yeah, It's always fun to see somebody get their first win. What a Unbelievable. Unbelievable.